All right, this is part two from the uh, last video. Now, I heard what Kazmaier said. And I mean, he does have really good, good advice for everyone on how to bench, deadlift, and everything else. I mean, there is certain ways to do it all. I do admit that. But when you're doing a dumbbell curl, if you want to have big arms, big shoulders, back, legs, the whole thing, and you're doing, let's just say, 70 pounds, okay. You can only do so many reps at a time and then you're wore out. Even if you eat all the protein there is, even if you eat all the vegetables there are, and Kazmaier is where you have to wait until it's all the way, once it's digested, then you go work out again. But I have a very hard time believing, and I, and I, I won't believe this. There is no way, unless you take roids, as I call them, steroids, mostly, or you take supplements, that, that you can go for hours and hours and hours and never be t t tired at all. And he actually will take you places with your muscles that no one will ever believe. I, I've seen it on so many guys on videos on shows i had a i had three or four neighbors on it i mean it is some potent crap it really is but i'm just making these videos for someone if you ever watch this that To even go to a gym and to go there for two to three hours or longer, it's, uh, I'm out of words. I really am. I mean, but some of the things I hear and I see from legends of powerlifting weight lifting about and I like all that but to me personally I mean I've been working out for, for 25 years I've tried the dieting to get totally mean like feel like I have abs and all that I had a, a very, very hard time. Then I turned into, I wanted to be bulky like my dad used to be. And he was all natural. And, and that's hard. That's very hard. I did it every day for six hours. And I was a, I was a nice size guy. But then I, I noticed if you quit working out and to take a break, Everything your muscles do go back down a little bit back down to normal. But if you take those supplements and you take those pills that, that you're not supposed to take, that in my eyes, it is cheating because that's not natural. You're, you're helping your muscle way more just so it takes less time if there's anybody out there 
that is as fit as the old, as the all the bodybuilders are, or as bulky as all the powerlifters, deadlifters, and everything else, and be that big and do all those reps. Then I'm all ears. It just really disappoints me that when I when I hear people hear guys talk about it, do this, do that, do this, do that. But if you have to take that shit, it's cheating. You're not using if you're eating the right foods and vegetables and, and mostly all protein. And you can get that big off of that. I'm a hundred percent. That's awesome. But, but honestly, I I have yet to even see it. Every time I watch videos, it, it always comes out that there's a tiny bit of lies. I I guess there's not one person. In this world that, that I have watched videos on, that's completely and 100% natural. Yet, the day I find out somebody has gotten the arms, legs, chest, and back from doing everything natural and can do reps on a bench, well, part three is coming up.